Hello everybody. I wanted to give you guys an update on, um, uh, uh, I keep wanting to say crafts. It's not craft. Well, some of it isn't. But anyway, things I've been working on. So this is a craft, but my turkey, you can't really tell, but the bottom part. And my pants I got from Emily's grandma. I fixed them. So they fit me, they fit my legs a lot better and they're a lot more my style. I bought a new sewing machine and uh, so I fixed those. Another thing I made recently is this rug. It's a little janky, but I am not a perfectionist. And also it's my first rug I've ever made besides like latch hook rugs. So I, um, it's one of my new hobbies that I've been enjoying getting into. My next one's going to be a square rug. And so, yeah, I've just been really getting into crafts lately. Um, so today I'm going to make some Dolly Parton pumpkin cookies. And I'm going to try, um, Tim got this kit to make Taco Bell at home. So <laughs> that's what we're doing today. You saying hello? So this is what Tim bought. It looks like it's something I could totally just buy um, separately, but <laughs> it still sounds like fun. Obviously the corn tortillas are nothing special, but I'm really excited about making homemade crunch wraps. This is what's inside the crunch wrap box tostadas there's four there's probably four tortillas taco bell seasoning and the cheese sauce so this is what's in the taco shell package taco seasoning sauce and what is that three six nine probably 12 taco shells i'm going to be using both of the taco seasonings because i have a lot of meat I'm cooking turkey and beef. It says to put half a cup of meat on the tortilla. I have meat I cooked with onions and the seasoning. And I also have some of my homemade beans. These were toasted for three minutes in the oven at 300. It says to put a dollop, whatever that means. Or did it say a tablespoon? Okay, it says tablespoon, about thumb sized dollop. So I put a little too much, but oh well. I'll just use this spoon. Did I, I don't even know if I showed it, but there's that. And it says to put it that way on top. Add sour cream. Ah, I'm scared. The tortilla, the tostada is breaking. Uh. One, two, three. There we go. And then it says, spray a skillet with cooking spray, place side down, this side down, over medium heat, one to two minutes on each side. Whew, she's heavy. Look at that. Got some Taco Bell sauce. I hope we have more. I think Tim's gonna want some. Dip it in. I already had a taco because I am hungry. I have been wanting to do this for like a couple weeks now. And so I didn't eat much before church. Ooh, so I'm hungry and ready for lunch.
It definitely needs more um, Taco Bell sauce. It's delicious. I feel like it's bigger than actual Taco Bell. And um, the only thing I would add is avocado. I have some over there. And more sauce, like hot sauce. But it's yummy. So I'm going to eat my lunch and then I'll probably reconvene when I make cookies. You want me to smell your hand? Did you make a wish? All right, I'm going to make some Dolly Parton pumpkin spice cookies. I am doubling the recipe. Tim bought a box, not knowing I already bought a box, so we have two. And I think it only makes 12 regular size cookies anyway, so this will make 24. So, um, and also, I don't have eggs, so I made some flax egg. And I don't have butter. So I'm using oil, but it's going to be just fine. It smells so good. Here's my flax egg. I like to make vegan eggs a lot anyways, because um, it's nice that I don't always have to like use egg for everything. All right, this dough is thick. This be them after 13 minutes. I'm going to make some cream cheese frosting. I ended up with 18 cookies. I was trying to make the big cookies. It was supposed to make 14, but I guess I didn't make them big enough. So I made 18. I made some cream cheese frosting. It's literally cream cheese and powdered sugar. I got this funny looking one. Let's try her out. It's extremely rich. Pumpkin-y, spicy, not like the um, Starbucks spicy, but the perfect flavor of pumpkin spice. My favorite flavor of pumpkin spice. There's like 400 different flavors of pumpkin spice, but this one is my favorite. It reminds me of pumpkin bread, pumpkin pie, all the pumpkin stuff. It's amazing. Um, I definitely do not recommend eating a whole one. It's a lot. It's so sweet. So rich. But delicious. So thank you for watching and have a great day.